As you can see, I am AI generated, and I love AI girls. But as you can see, a lot of real people on Instagram and TikTok seem to like them as well. I saw a lot of videos on how to create AI influencers already, but all of them had one thing in common. They were far from optimal. However, if you are looking for the best way to create your very own AI influencer, this video will be the only one you'll need. I'll show you the step-by-step -step formula to create consistent and beautiful characters by training your own model. And trust me, it's really easy. In addition, I'll also show you how to create Instagram and TikTok videos using your character. To top things off, I'll also show you how to promote your generated influencer and make him famous. Don't believe me. Let me show you. In the first step, we'll get our character. You have several options here. You can either use an AI tool like Midjourney or Cart.ai to create your very own character. Alternatively, you could use the explore sections of their websites to grab your character there. As a third alternative, you could also use a website that offers free or paid stock photos and grab your character there. Once you have your character and you are satisfied with it, we'll move on to the next step. In the second step, we'll need some images of persons that look pretty similar to our character. In theory, it's not necessary that they are completely similar, but the higher the similarity, the better the results are going to be in the end. We'll use these images later on and replace their faces using our character. Therefore, make sure that especially the bodies look pretty similar and could be a good fit. Once you have your images and saved them to your PC, we'll move on to the next step. In this step, we'll swap the faces of our characters. There are many ways and tools out there to change the faces of the downloaded images with that of your character. To perform the face swap, start by creating a private Discord server. Once that's done, add the face swap bot to your Discord server. To do this, click on the GitHub link in the description. On the website, click the Discord bot invitation link to invite the bot to your previously created Discord server. On the Discord server, use the slash save ID command followed by the name you want to give your AI influencer. After that, drag the image of your model into the box and press enter. This action will link a name with the appearance of your influencer. Now, you can use the saved look to transfer it to your previously downloaded images by using the slash swap ID command, followed by the previously defined name of your influencer. Drag similar images into the box. This will change their faces with the face of your influencer. Repeat this process for all the images you previously downloaded and save them to your PC. Now that we have pretty similar images of our model, we'll proceed with training our very own model. To train the model, we need to crop our images first. When training the model, it is essential that the images have a specific resolution. In our case, we'll use 512 x 512 pixels. You can use any program to crop your images to the desired size. I'll use Photoshop here, but you could also use free image editing programs like Photopea or GIMP, for example. Export all of your images with the desired resolution. To train our own model, we could, of course, download Stable Diffusion on our PC and use it for training. However, it's much easier to use Leonardo AI. I'll also include a link in the description below. Once you're on the website, create your account or log in. Now go to Training and Datasets. Right here you can select New Dataset. Give your dataset a name and a description in case you want to describe it. Now press Create Dataset. Drag all of your previously cropped images into the image area here. Once all of them are uploaded, click on Train Model. 
Again, give your model a name. Feel free to select a base model for your project. I'll use Stable Diffusion version 1.5. In the next step, also create an instance prompt. That is basically the text you'll use later on to instruct the image generator to create your character with your generated model. To finish the setup, click on Start Training. This process might take a while. I could always finish the process in a couple of minutes, but this might differ for you. Once your model has finished training, you can start using it. To do so, click on Image Generation on the left. Here you can click on all available models and click Select Other Models in the drop-down menu. Go to your models and select your previously trained model by clicking on View, followed by Generate with this model. Now it's time for a prompt. Use the prompt you previously defined to start off your request. Afterward, you can describe the image you want to generate. It might take some time to get the results you are looking for. Feel free to experiment with the settings and prompts to further increase the quality of your trained model. You can always save the good images to your PC and use them to train your model repeatedly. With every iteration, the quality and similarity of your creations should increase. This might take some time, but trust me, the results are definitely worth it. In the first step, we actually need videos from a girl with a body and hair similar to our influencers. Last time, many people asked where to find copyright-free videos that can be used for commercial purposes. There are numerous websites out there providing free or paid stock footage. Pexels is an example of a free website, while iStock offers amazing videos for a small fee. In this video, I'll use a clip of real Instagram girls for demonstration purposes. In a real-life scenario, you should put in some effort to find the right videos for your project. Once you have the video, head over to the Google Colab linked in the description. First, it might look intimidating, but don't worry. It's straightforward, and I'll guide you through the process. Start by running the first cell. Wait until the first cell finishes executing. Once done, move both your target video and the image of your model into the left sidebar. Ensure that there are no spaces in the file names to avoid potential errors. In the next step, run the second cell named Download Model. Again, wait for the code to execute before proceeding. Now, let's move on to the final step. In the Deepfake section, remove the part that says Output Video Quality 80 to prevent errors. Now, we'll specify the path of our target video and the image of our influencer's face. Retrieve the path by right-clicking on the file, selecting Copy Path. Now, copy the paths into the sections after Target and Source. Run the last cell and patiently wait for your video to finish processing. And that's it. You now have your very own AI-generated influencer video. However, a video without the right promotion is not worth much. So how do you get famous? There are various strategies to promote your influencer effectively. It's crucial to create a distinctive influencer that stands out from the masses, as the best promotion won't work if your influencer lacks uniqueness and is forgotten within minutes. Fortunately, obtaining a unique character using AI shouldn't be too challenging. Once you have a unique character, consider leveraging multiple platforms to expand your following. Relying solely on Instagram is a common mistake. It's never been easier to go viral with virtual influencers on platforms like TikTok, for example. Therefore, I strongly recommend utilizing multiple platforms and cross-linking all your socials on each of them. This way, followers from Instagram may explore TikTok and vice versa. Of course, you can also consider investing in the initial views and follows through paid methods. There are various paid promotional avenues for influencers such as Google Ads, Facebook Ads, and more. Follow these steps diligently, and you're sure to find success on your influencer journey.